Hey guys, what is up? We are going to be doing something a little different today. I've never really tried to do lit art and like what I want to do is kind of going to involve us having to do lit art a little bit, kind of, sort of. Um, for those of you who don't know, uh, Makeup by Haley has recently started her own nail business, which a lot of people are doing during quarantine. I'm noticing this. Like, a lot of my friends have started nail businesses, and I can't wear fake nails at work. So it's really frustrating. Like, I want to support, but I can't support. But I want to support. I do. Truly. All of you. Like, uh, Trisha, uh, Kat is starting one. Haley has one. Rory has one. Like, everyone has nails, and I can't wear them, and it's driving me nuts. All I can do is like retweet their posts. I'm so sorry guys, but I support any way that I can. But um, Haley posted a picture of a set of nails that she did the other day. And like, I don't know what it is about this picture. I'll throw it up. It inspired me. I was like, I want to do that, but on my eyes. So <laughs> that's what we're attempting to do today. What I'm thinking I'm going to do, I want to do like a cool like ombre lip thing too. Like it's, it's going to be really really cool but very dramatic and I also have to go get gas after this so I'm kind of debating like do I leave the makeup on or do I do the normal thing and not go out in public looking like a freak we'll see it's late at night no one's gonna know I just gotta get gas that's all anyway <laughs> what I'm thinking we're gonna do is I want to do like uh gray to black gradient up here but like more black than gray you know what i mean like just like kind of start like like light gray then like a little bit of darker gray and then like black on the eyes and then we're gonna do kind of a graphic liner up and then flames but i want to do like green flames and then like there's a lot of gold to that too and i thought i had a gold paint but i don't so i'm like i don't know like i have a pastel yellow or I can do like a neon yellow and I'm thinking neon because like when in doubt, neon it out. Trademark. Um, so that's my plan. And then I want to do like black and then kind of, I want to do like a little bit of the green and then yellow on the lips. And I think that'll like kind of tie everything together. Maybe. That's my plan. We'll see if I pull it off. Stay tuned. <laughs> So for the eyes, um, I am going to go in with the Alien palette. Whether you support Jeffrey or not, you can't deny his formula is bomb. Okay? Just, just saying. So we're going to go in with the Alien palette. And I'm going to do, like I said, like kind of just a gray gradient, but heavier towards the black end of the spectrum. So that's the plan. So we'll start with tall gray and then we'll go to ghost OG and then black hole. Okay, so here's the look, so to speak, but we're going to do the liner now. Now I did go with uh, alien underneath the eye because it's kind of a neon green. And then um, I did interstellar in the inner corner, I believe. But now we're gonna do the liner and I am using my wicked paint pot and this is shade Cypress which I, I don't think these are available anymore for sale this is she's going with the new formula but they're really good for line work so maybe she'll continue them I'm not sure just kind of repurpose them maybe just throwing it out there. But they work really good for detail work. I think I need a finer tip brush actually for what I really want to do. Let me Ooh, that's pretty fine tipped. Okay. Okay, I can't know if it really reads, but there's like little flames. That's what we're trying for at least. 
a lot of hard work with this tiny little brush. The thing I'm going to do is actually take another small brush and go in the outlines with my white concealer and then get my neon white or my neon yellow pigment and fill it in maybe I think that's gonna look cool so we might be done with the paint pot or I might come back to it I'm not sure I'm not sure we'll see how tedious it is to fill this in with my white concealer that's First of all, I gotta find my white concealer because I still haven't straightened this out. T. <laughs> I'm always a mess. You guys know this. Yeah, right in front of me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I need to organize. <sighs> sometimes I hate being me, but sometimes I can't help but be me. You know? Like. Literally, I can't help it. This is what I got. I am what I am. All right, got my white elf concealer, and I'm just going to fill in the flame area. You know what, actually? Hold up. I have a neon yellow that I have out and ready to go, but it's in the living room because I just got it recently and it's sitting with all my other makeup that I haven't like filmed with yet. So hold up, let me go grab that and we'll use that. This is a brand new pigment from Star Gem Cosmetics, use code Belonity, called Electrona. And I have not used this yet. We're just gonna bust it open and try it out. I actually have like a different thing that I was gonna do with this. Like a separate video just showing you guys like how to work with loose pigments. Stay tuned for that. I'll probably have that up this week sometime. But in the meantime, I'm just going to do this. And then we'll go into how to actually work with pigments at a later date. Sound good? Because <laughs> I don't know about you guys, but like when I first got started, I found loose pigments like really intimidating. And now I don't. I'm going to put a lid on that before I have yellow pigment all over the place because I will knock this off. I know me. I know me. All right. I'm going to go back into the paint pot and kind of touch up some of these lines a little bit. All right. Now we've got that touched back up again. Um, I am going to actually go in a little bit with the white concealer again, just to sort of accentuate the flames a little bit. Cause I don't feel like it's really rating that they're flames. <laughs> Gotta have a little spark to them, you know? Okay, now we're going to do the lips. <laughs> now, uh, my idea is to do kind of black, then green, then yellow. We'll see how well I pull this off. I do have a black and a yellow lipstick, and I was just going to use the paint pot on that. I think it's safe. I'm going to be taking this off soon anyway, so like it can't poison me that bad, right? I think this just is a weird look. I think it's just a weird look. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about these lips. I don't know how I feel about these lips. I think maybe instead of trying to do like a weird three color ombre, one color of which not even being lipstick, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do black. I feel like that looks less weird now, but I kind of want to try lining it. I kind of like that. Okay. 
Okay, like I said, this is a weird look. It's not a normal look for me. But this is the look that we got. <laughs> All right, I'm going to wind this up. <laughs> Thanks for dealing with me, guys. <laughs> I don't know, this is not what I had in my head, like at all, like this, mm, maybe I'm not ready for lit art, I don't think I'm ready for lit art, but I had to try, so thanks for watching me try and do a really weird look, I'm gonna slap lashes on, finish a TikTok or two, and then take all of this off, because I am not going to the gas station looking like this. What if someone sees me? I don't want to have to explain this. Like, I don't feel like getting stared at. It's late. I love you guys so much.